All right, Rock, well, you know, taking a look at the fact that this isn't obviously how you wanted to finish it up, but at one point, Bayheim's Army was down by 22. You guys cut it to three. Mm -hmm. Just what you can say about, you know, the fight that was in this team. Uh, we, we wasn't going to give up. We just had to play hard. That's what we did. I mean, some calls didn't go our way, but like I said, it's, it's a game. You can't, you can't uh, bet on those things. So we just had to play our game, and I mean, they made a tough three at the end to win the game. So, yeah physical game obviously and, and you you know you being inside you don't shy away from anything like that so just what you could say about the physicality oh uh, they let us get after it i mean at the end of the game i i mean we're not playing anymore but you can't call no double foul at the end of the game like that but i mean the refs already know how i play so i thought they were they wasn't gonna do that but i mean shit happens and like i said congrats to them and we just gotta play harder next time the thing that's in the background of all of this and, and lives with you is the fact that you get to, you know, reunite with your teammates and play with guys you never got an opportunity yeah. to play with. So just what that's like. Oh, that's great. I mean, I haven't played with Jimmy, Dolajai, Matt, and of them. It's great coming back to play with CJ and, and Tyler and all of them. So, I mean, it's a great to reunite with everybody. We haven't been back in a while. So just to be able to come back and be around the fans and stuff like that, it's, I mean, I'm mad we lost, but I mean, shit happens. You just got to put it behind us and get ready for next year. Tyler Ennis, uh, specifically him, hey, seeing him come back, and obviously he wasn't able to go in this game, but just what it was like to be out on the floor because I look back at some of those pictures where you're kind of like picking yeah. at his head and stuff. So just what it's like to have him back with you. Oh, I felt great. I mean, like I said, it was Tyler's like my little brother. I'm probably the reason why he came to play this year. I was at his house, told him let's do it, and he said, let's fine, let's do it. So, I mean, like I said, it's great to be back with everybody, and it was a great experience, and hopefully next year we can play stronger. CJ underneath. I talked to him about it a bit, you know, having you guys back together again. Just what it's like to be in a front court with CJ. Uh, great. CJ was my roommate my freshman year, sophomore year probably. But, I mean, like I said, being just family with everybody, just happy to be back. Fans cheering us on. We didn't get to win, but like I said, just happy to be back, be back in the, in the orange. Jimmy was running around the gym his whole life. You know, him and Buddy, and, and so he said he, you know, never thought that he would get this opportunity. What was it like to have Jimmy out there? Oh, it was great. Like you said, Jimmy and Buddy, everyone, Hops kids, Reds kids, they're all running around, just goofing around, just seeing them grow up. Um, I'm an old man at this point, so <laughs> just to see him growing up and him doing good, big things is, is great. So it was a great experience to play with Jimmy as well. You mentioned Dolajai. I have a lot of respect for him. He was a utility belt for Syracuse being somebody that played on the inside at forward and center and then seeing him have to play center at times and play forward, watching him from afar and then being being able to be his teammate, what can you say about Marek? It's crazy. I mean, he was holding it down when he was here, so I didn't know he was that – I know he was skinny, but I know he was that skinny. <laughs> but, I mean, he did his thing here, holding it down and just doing what he normally does. So it's definitely a great experience, and he's a good player.